Once upon a time, in the quaint village of Dreamscape, lived a young girl named Lily. She had a heart as pure as a crystal clear stream and a curious mind that craved adventure. Every night, Lily would drift off to sleep, eager to explore the magical realm of dreams. But one night, something changed. As she closed her eyes, a sense of unease washed over her. The dream world that once welcomed her with open arms now felt different, darker somehow. Lily found herself trapped in a recurring nightmare, unable to escape its clutches. In this unsettling dream, she wandered through a dense forest shrouded in mist. Strange whispers echoed around her, and the trees seemed to whisper back. Every step she took felt heavy, burdened by an invisible weight. No matter how fast she ran, she couldn't escape the relentless pursuit of a shadowy figure, always just beyond her sight. The more Lily tried to fight back against this recurring nightmare, the stronger it became. She couldn't understand why this was happening, as her days were filled with laughter and joy, but as the nightmares persisted, it began to take a toll on her waking life. She felt tired and anxious during the day, her once bright spirit dimming like a fading star. Lily decided to seek the wisdom of the village's dream sage, an old woman known for her knowledge of dreams and their mysteries. The wise woman listened intently as Lily poured out her heart, describing the haunting nightmares that plagued her sleep. Ah, my child, the dream sage spoke softly, her eyes filled with compassion. Nightmares are not merely figments of imagination, they are messengers trying to convey something deep within you. Lily was puzzled, but what could my nightmares possibly be trying to tell me? I don't understand. The dream sage smiled gently and began to explain, Dreams are the gateways to our subconscious minds, where our deepest fears and worries reside. Sometimes, when we experience stress or anxiety, our minds try to process these emotions during sleep. Nightmares are like mirrors, reflecting back the turmoil we may not even be aware of while awake. Lily listened intently, the realization slowly dawning upon her. So, my nightmares are trying to tell me that something is troubling me, something I need to face? The dream sage nodded approvingly, exactly my dear, instead of running away from your nightmares, try to confront them, see what they represent, and you may find the key to releasing their hold on you. Encouraged by the dream sage's guidance, Lily decided to embrace her nightmares with courage. The following night, as she found herself in the eerie forest once again, she stopped running from the shadowy figure and turned to face it. As she gazed into the darkness, the figure started to transform, and to Lily's surprise, it took the shape of her own fears and self-doubts. She saw her worries about not being good enough, fears of failure, and anxieties about the unknown. As she confronted these emotions head-on, the figure began to dissipate, leaving behind a sense of relief. From that night on, the nightmares gradually faded away, replaced by dreams of wonder and discovery. Lily had learned the valuable lesson that nightmares were not to be feared, but embraced as a part of her own growth and self-awareness. And so, in the village of Dreamscape, Lily's story became a legend, reminding everyone that even in the darkest of dreams, there is a glimmer of light waiting to be found, the light of understanding and self-acceptance.